Hey, hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys. As always, um, the screen's flipping around like crazy, but I am happy to be here with y'all. I'm going to remove this freaking tree right here, and then that's going to be this episode. <laughs> I'm just playing. So I already upgraded my Dark Elixir uh, drill to level 2 um, when you guys weren't watching. Also, I researched my Barbarian, so they are max right now, um, for, or they're max for my Town Hall 8. Next, what I'm probably going to research is uh, going to be the archers, uh, which are 2,250,000, so I can't do that right now. Uh, one thing that I am going to be doing in this video is upgrading another wizard tower, and as you can see, this one right here is about to be max. In fact, I could finish it, but, eh, you know, no real reason to. Uh, so we're going to save the rest of that. Um, I have a full army camp of uh, my, uh, what the heck is it? of just my lazy farming strategies, so just archers, barbarians, and goblins. Uh, we're going to get a raid in in this video, but why don't we go ahead and upgrade one of our wizard towers right now. So there we go. Four days. That thing will be done and good to go. Um, and then let's see. Our mortars, we need 1,600,000. So if I get a 1 million gold raid in this video, <laughs> I'm just playing, <laughs> uh, then I could have upgraded those. But... Um, yeah, so what we can upgrade with, somebody just started following me on Instagram, molt underscore coc if you want to follow me on Instagram. It's a zero, M0LT. Uh, so there you go. This lighting is like miserable right now, so I'm just going to kind of look this direction. Um, so yeah, why don't we, uh, can I upgrade this again? No, I can't. Um, I think what we should upgrade with our elixir. Um, I don't think we can upgrade. We can't upgrade any of our barracks or anything. Uh, Spell factory. Nope. You need to be town hall nine for that. Um, our Teslas. I also upgraded this Tesla to level two. So that's where that is at. Uh, and I could upgrade my storage, but I don't need to do that. Why don't we go ahead and just go on the attack and see what we can find. I'm going to break that shield because I can probably get about two attacks out of this. And look at this base right up the bat, guys. That is what we are definitely looking for. We probably won't even have to use our entire army composition on this. Uh, so let's go ahead and drop down some barbarians as distraction for the mortars. Wait for those shells to hit. Go ahead and drop a couple wall breakers. Um, drop down some goblins to help us out. That wall breaker is running in there. <laughs> and uh, we can go ahead and just let our wizards, or <laughs> our wizards, we can let our archers just run up in there and um, some of our barbarians, and we're not going to deploy too much because honestly I think that we will be able to get the majority of the loot on the inside. Let's go ahead and take out this archer tower right here, um, and let's go ahead and take out the town hall as well just because I do want to kind of get up a little bit more in trophies. Um, we are going to drop our barbarian king down as distraction, and we are going to get these goblins inside, but the king went the wrong way, so most of those goblins are going to die from that wizard tower. But we are getting a majority of that loot um, right there. So let's go ahead and drop down some more of our archers. And we actually probably will end up just deploying everything because there's still a lot of elixir in there uh, that I want to get. So, uh, Which is okay. I don't really mind. So we got all the gold, which is a good amount of gold, um, especially for how cheap this army composition is. Uh, our king is down, but we will be able to take out this big thing of elixir right here. Um, and hopefully we can work our way around. Let's take out this cannon. What is over there? That army camp is over there. Uh, let's try and take out these cannons uh, as well. I'll go ahead and drop down a couple wall breakers right there to get us in there because we really want to get all of this uh, all of this elixir right here. So once that level like two cannons down, um, then our archer, archers should be able to hang out up here at the top and just take out the majority of that elixir. Um, I'm very surprised we didn't get the rest of this elixir right here. Uh, I thought we had enough troops to do that, but that's fine. Um, wow, there's still a lot left. And there all of them go. So now the question is, do I drop my lightning spells on it? <laughs> uh, shoot, I don't even know how much these are. I think they're like 20,000 each or something. Um, and we definitely can't destroy those. Um, so we'll probably just go ahead and leave that. I know, sad times. Um, but 149,000 gold is good. 47 thousand elixir definitely pays for uh, the army composition uh, without a doubt 
So, yeah. But, guys, Clan Wars is coming out very, very soon. I'm going to go ahead and fill these up while I talk to y'all. Uh, but Clan Wars is coming out very, very soon, and I'm sure that I haven't posted any videos on it because, you know, everybody else is doing a really, really good job of it, like uh, Godson and Chief Pat and uh, everyone else who went to Finland, so Daddy and uh, Simon Tay, all are doing a really, really good job of um, of talking about it. <clears throat> so that's why I haven't posted any videos on it because, honestly, theirs are perfect, so you can go check theirs out. But one thing that I do know about it is that uh, once you have a preparation day where you can redesign your base, at the end of that, they take a picture of your base, and then you can go back to your old farming base if you want to, and then people battle based off of that. Um, so what I'm going to be doing, most likely, is... Uh, keeping this base and just turning it into a hybrid base. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring all of these... Wait, why did I bring that out? Yeah, I'll put it back in there in a second. So if you guys are using my base design and you want to get ready for Clan Wars, then uh, what you can do is you can bring the Town Hall in right here. Yep, I know. <laughs> and uh, honestly, uh, we'll probably go ahead and... Um, we won't want, I, I don't really care as much about Dark Elixir as I will about Elixir during this. So we're going to put our Clan Castle right in there in the center, as well as that other Elixir storage. Um, and then I think what we're going to do is, uh, shoot, what was it? I'm trying to remember exactly what I did. Uh, so obviously I'm going to take these out and put our storages like this in here. Um, so now those are in there. And then our mortar, we're going to have to move. So I'll probably take, I might take this air defense, put this wizard tower right up here, um, take this, probably put the mortar right here. Now that's, that's super exposed. Um, we're going to take the wizard tower actually, and uh, we'll put the mortar right here in the center just to help protect the base. You can see it pretty much covers the entire top. Um, although this little, this bottom portion of the base is exposed, um, but the mortars are, are pretty safe on the inside. So, uh, let's go ahead and put our air defense, uh, back where it was. So we can leave the air defense right there to really help protect this top portion from any kind of air troops. Um, and then we can put our wizard tower right here. Uh, and then I might want to, just to spread things out a little bit, uh, when it comes to the wizards, bring the wizards over let's put the mortar right here so that it's protected bring this wizard right here and bring this air defense right here and then again we will do the same thing on this side we will bring the wizard in here and we will put the mortar right here um, and then that is going to be it for that and then this little area right here is just going to be open honestly you can bring these giant bombs in here uh, if you want to for anything that might run up in there so this is just for if you're using my base and you don't want to redesign a new one and you just want to do it for Clan Wars and then go back to how it was. Uh, so that's what you would do in that case. And then uh, go ahead and take a screenshot if you want to. I'll leave that right there for a second. And screenshot, good job. <laughs> uh, but I'm going to put it back to how it is or to how I like it right now. Um, so let's go ahead and bring these giant bombs back out here. Come on. I need to get a freaking iPad or something to do all this on because this, this gets old real quick. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and put that back in there. Uh, we're going to put that Dark Elixir in there. I believe that our King was in here as well. And was a Mortar in there or was a Wizard Tower in there? Shoot, I'm all over the place, man. Alright, so I know that was in there for sure. And then these were in here. The Wizard Tower was right here, I believe. I don't know how I already forgot that. So all that goes in there. Um, <clears throat> so I think this is a little bit different. I don't think the mortars were the mortars weren't like that, but hey, it's fine. They're still doing their job. I think that they were where the wizard towers are. So here's one option for you going back uh, to reorganizing how it is. Um, I don't think that this is this isn't bad uh, by any means. The the wizards do a good job of covering everything still, just like the mortars do. Uh, so yeah, there's that, and let's see uh, what we can... Can we upgrade a cannon or anything? Oh, we're so close. We can almost upgrade a cannon. We just need 100,000 more. Um, how many troops do we have? 73? You guys think we can, you guys think we can uh, lazy farm? <laughs> let's go. Let's see if we can get ourselves 100,000 
uh, gold real quick to upgrade a cannon for us. Uh, maybe, 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 maybe we can find a base that has uh, a bunch of stuff on the outside of it. Ah, oh, that one doesn't have it on the outside. Dang it. <laughs> I do this so often when I'm just like, oh my gosh, I need gold. Uh, this base actually might, we might be able to get in there to all that gold. Uh, watch. So we're going to drop these guys down here. Spring traps are going to take us. We're going to drop our wall breaker. Hopefully it'll get in there. Open that up. Yep, there we go. And let's go ahead and... No, come on. There we go, goblins. All right, so goblins are going in now. And our barbarians are going in as well. Where are his wizard towers? Does he only have one wizard tower? Nice. All right, so those goblins are already in there getting that gold for us. Um, take out that giant. <clears throat> I really want to take out that mortar right there. Because he is doing work on... I'm going to take out this mortar. I know it might seem like it's a little late, uh, but that is going to get us some gold, too, that we might be able to use. Uh, what was it? Was it 700,000 for... Uh, or was it 800,000? <laughs> I don't remember. I'm going to use this other lightning spell right here, though, uh, and see how much we can get from that. So, what was that? Like 11,000 gold? Yeah. 90,000? <laughs> Dang it. Do I need 800? I think I need 800 to upgrade it. I already forgot. Yeah, so I need 800. Oh, my gosh. We're going to do this. Watch. You guys are going to see how freaking lazy I am when it comes to this. Um, all right. So we need to find... <laughs> We're going to do it. Watch. You guys are going to crack up. Let's find another base. Um, and I know we don't have that much uh, when it comes to our troops right now. In fact, we only have like 15. So we're going to find a base that has... Uh, so it has 24. I wonder if any of it's in the storages. Let's just do this. We're going to do this. We're going to do this, and mortar is dropping, and we are going to do this. Come on, get us 800,000. There we go. <laughs> 800,000 right there. The absolute laziest way to do it. Uh, we can go ahead and surrender. I did just lose trophies, 29 of them. Whatever, I just wanted to get enough to upgrade this cannon. Um, so we're going to upgrade a cannon as well for you guys in this video. Uh, so let's go over here. Let's upgrade this one. Now I have no loot to search with, but that's perfectly fine. Um, and then let's go in here and train up some more troops. And then that is going to be it for this 12-minute episode for you guys. I um, hope that you all liked it. I wasn't really planning on doing a little base redesign in it, but uh, on the fly I was like, yeah, you know, why don't we do that? Um, so there we go. Enough troops in there. That is upgraded, and we are doing really, really well. I might as well just go ahead and upgrade this thing for six hours because I'm going to go to bed soon. Um, so there we go. whole bunch of upgrades in this video, guys. We are moving on up. I can't wait for this Town Hall uh, 8 base to have all level 8 walls because last time I had a Town Hall 8, it didn't have all level 8 walls. So I'm definitely going to max everything out on this. I'm going to even try and max out the King on it, uh, which will be sweet. Oh, no. Somebody's calling me. <laughs> Decline. <laughs> that was ridiculous there's there it is uh so that's gonna be it for this episode though guys thank you so much for watching i really do appreciate it i will see you guys later as always make sure you keep calm and clash on for me right see ya